What is going on, my Padawans? Master Zane here with the finals of the Little Oppressors League. We're playing against Z-Man, and I'm excited to bring this to you guys. I'll give you his team real quick. Uh, he has got the Dragapult, Infernape, Tapacoco, Umbreon, Mega Blastoise, Silvalli, uh, Regilecki, Whimsicott, Registeel, Crobat, Uxie, and Dugong. And I am going to be bringing Power Up Punch, Scale Shot, Mega Sceptile, uh, Smooth Rock, Ferrothorn with Sandstorm into our Choice Banded Stone Edge Lycanroc, Cassie Berry Hoopa, our Weezing, and our Choice Scarf Urshifu. Without further ado. Oh boy, here we go, here we go. Let's start it up. Oh no, he did bring Dugong! What a dude! That's amazing. I am... If I lose, then I don't even care that I lost. That's... That's amazing. Oh, gosh. Alright. So he does have Umbreon, which is super scary. However... <clears throat> Lycanroc can do okay. I need to get Registeel out of the way, though. That's important. Um, it looks like... Looks like Urshifu can be good in this game, too. If Whimsicott and Dragapult are out of the way, then Wim or Urshifu does well as, as well. So, I think what we're going to do... Let's see, what else does well? Uh, Sceptile can't beat uh, Whimsicott, unfortunately. Uh, I think what I can do early is... Hoopa's really good in this game, too. Uh, I can't let this thing hit me with a foul play, though. So, I could lead off with Weezing and get Toxic Spikes down. Toxic Spikes was going to be good. A little nervous. I don't want him to lead Weezing and have Dragapult just beat me. So, I'm going to lead Weezing anyway. He does lead with Whimsicott, so this is a great lead for us. Um, I could throw off a Sludge Bomb. However, he's probably going to go Registeel. So I think what I'm going to do is... I'm going to go for a T-Spike right here. Does go Registeel. That's great. Now we can go into Urshifu. Let's see how much Urshifu does to a Registeel. Um, it doesn't do a whole lot. What am I actually, what am I saying? He doesn't do a lot to me. So I think going straight Urshifu here is good. Gives me some leverage. Yeah. If I can get this thing gone, then I'm going to be in good shape. Uh, I can't let him go Dragapult, so I just have to U-turn here. So he is going to go Dragapult. He's going to be poisoned. And he's Rocky Helmet Dragapult. Interesting. Okay. I don't know what this thing wants to do necessarily then. Um, I could go Hoopa and throw off a Shadow Ball. Does Focus Blast... How much does that do to Umbreon is my question. Focus Blast does not quite do half. Or, it's a chance to be do over half. So... I think Hoopa is good right here. <clears throat> if I Trick Room... I can't Trick Room here. I just need to go for Shadow Ball. Goes Umbreon. Nice. So we get this thing poisoned. Um, and I'm not even going to worry about this thing. I'm going to go straight into Weezing, I think. He might Heal Bell here. Or I could go Urshifu and get a lot of momentum. I'm going to go Urshifu and get a lot of momentum. Goes for Wish. U-turn's going to hurt. U-turn is going to hurt. Um, 
if he stays in with it, then I can go for... Go into Ferrothorn. So he does go back into Dragapult. This is good. We're getting a lot of momentum here. He does have that um, Rocky Helmet, though. So... Could switch it up here. This thing's getting low. I don't know what... Uh... It's Rocky Helmet. Can... I can't go Sceptile yet because he still has Whimsicott. So I'm going to go into... I think Ferrothorn's fairly safe here. I'm going to go Ferrothorn. So he did get his Wish back up. I go for Gyro Ball, he... Let's see. How much is the Flamethrower gonna do to me? It's not doing a whole lot, however... A little nervous because... That would not give me my Sandstorm. Although he still does have Registeel. I could double into Weezing, actually. Flamethrower is not really nice. Kind of went into this thing a little bit too early. I'm going to try to go into Weezing. Okay, he goes in Fernape, actually. This isn't bad for us. I think this is fine. I can't let this thing set up. And at this point, Sludge Bomb is a Tuco. So... I think this will work. Goes U-turn. Good play. Probably going to go into Registeel. Yep, he does. Um, this thing is so scary to my team. I have a feeling this is a rest. This is a rest set. I'm going to try to go for Willow right here. I get the Willow off. Does go for Body Press. Does very little. So now I can go into... Hmm. A Burned... Body Press. He is Burned... See, the thing is, I can't really do anything to him. Body Press is not doing a lot to Ferrothorn, so I can go right back into Ferrothorn, actually. So apparently he doesn't have Heal Bell on Umbreon. He's just kind of giving me his sets. Wow! Crit! No! Why did it do that much? Body press has screwed me over so much this season. Like, I don't get it. I don't get it. Oh, is he like, is he banded? He might be banded actually. Hold on. Wait, hold on. It was a crit, too. That might be... 
That's probably max defense. I don't know if the choice band helps it or not. Does the choice band help it? What if he's lefties? Oh, that thing is banded. This thing's actually banded. All right, so now he's into Infernape. All right, banded Registeel. Crazy. Um... I'm gonna check to see what this thing likes to do. If it has any coverage for Hoopa. A Shadow Claw. At this point, I don't think anything's taking us out. So... I still don't like this, though. I want to go into Weezing. Yeah. U-turn. Fine. Gonna go straight back into Registeel. That's crazy. Alright, now he goes into Dragapult. Sludge Bomb's not it. I can't go into Hoopa Dry. Alright, here's the thing. Do I need Lycanroc to be the way that it is? Kind of yes. Kind of yes. Once Dragapult goes down, then... What is a minus everything? What has he revealed? He hasn't revealed anything yet. So I could go for Memento here, although I don't want to do that because I'm so like so healthy. He hasn't revealed anything. He might even be defensive because he's Rocky Helmet. Ah, it's a tough place to be at right now. I don't really need Ferrothorn in this match. I'm gonna go Ferrothorn. Goes Draco, okay. That was really nice for us. That was actually super nice for us. So now... I can click Leech Seed right here. And if he goes Whimsicott, then that's fine. All right, so now he's at an Infernape. He's probably just going to expect me to go into Weezing. I'm going to click Sandstorm right here. Ooh, he clicks Slack Off. Alright. So Sandstorm was not a bad play. If he kills me right now... I do a decent amount with Gyro Ball. Yeah, if he kills me, it's going to hurt him more than it hurts me. The time is now, I think, to go into... Uh, it's not time to go into it, is the problem. I could go into Urshifu here. Ooh, or I could go... What is Protective Pads? Iron Barbs, okay. What is... Um... I could scale shot here. I could scale shot here. 
However, Whimsicott still exists. Actually, I could go into Sceptile and then... What is my speed after I Mega Evolve? Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into Sceptile and bait the Whimsicott. Should I do that? No, I should not do that. I need to click a move here. I'm going to Mega Evolve and click Earthquake, I think. Earthquake does the best against his team. Can't overpredict. All right, I take the Infernape. That's good. That's good. We'll take that. Could have touched the Elscott. Yeah, scale shot there. But that could have been bad. Be smart, I'll go Whimsicott. Umbreon's not a bad play either. I'm scared about Dugong. Dugong is scary. I don't know what he wants to do. I'm kind of in a weird spot because Ferrothorn's gone. This thing hasn't even... Okay, he did click Draco. So that gives me an idea. Uh, actually, Lycanroc can kind of deal with Dragapult then. Urshifu is fine once Dragapult's out of the way. He goes into Dugong, and I'm scared. Oh, no. Um, so he's going to get hit. Leaf Blade is... I'm so scared of Dugong. I'm so scared of Dugong. If this thing runs max defense, if he's, if he's max defense, he lives and kills me with Ice Beam. And I can't let Sceptile die. If he whirlpools, then I'm in big trouble. So I think I need to go into Urshifu. Let me see what else. What, let me see what Dugong has. Like, when I say I'm scared of Dugong, I'm scared of Dugong. Like, nothing. Alright, we can go into Urshifu here, I think. Ice Shard. Alright. Getting a little low. Could read something here and try to go for Ice Punch. Ice Punch seems like a good play. We gotta make a play. Dragapult goes down! No, it doesn't go down! Oh no! Oh no! Please tell me this thing doesn't have like Roost. Uh, we can't let Urshifu die yet. That cannot happen. So, have to go into... Let's go into Hoopa here. Yeah. Uh, Hoopa's kind of important. Hoopa's not exactly... A win con though. I think Weezing's more important. So let's go into Hoopa. Oh no. Sleep talk. Alright, Shadow Ball should kill. Goes into Umbreon. Get a Spadef drop. So now we can click Focus Blast. Oh, are we gonna outspeed this thing? Oh, this might be a problem. I might have had. See, I was planning on... I should have clicked... Uh, 
trick room there. What is my speed? 176. Okay, so I didn't take off any uh, speed IVs. So I should be able to click Focus Blast here. Yes! Focus Miss actually hit. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That was huge. That was huge. Wow. Focus Miss actually hit. I'm shocked beyond belief. Alright. Um, unfortunately, Lycanroc can't do a whole lot. Actually, Lycanroc's fairly useless right now. I need to get... Um, I needed Registeel gone if I wanted Lycanroc to do work. Sandstorm was trying to be there, but it just was not quite it. Um, however, ah, that's the thing though, like he still has Whimsicott, so I can't win with Sceptile. He's gonna have trouble going into something here though, cause this thing's burned. I don't know what this thing wants to do. This thing really can't touch me. And then Whimsicott, Whimsicott's gonna have to kind of do something here. Hoopa might just win us this game. And I'm glad I kept it around. I'm glad I didn't take the Draco, because I can still live a Shadow Ball. And I know I can definitely live a Shadow Ball now that I know that he's Rocky Helmets. Yeah, Shadow Ball barely does half. It's a good game so far. He's playing pretty well. I'm playing decently. Um, yeah. Rest Dragapult's scary. Although it's nice because he's going to be asleep for two turns max. Or min. I think he has to be asleep for two turns. Is he going into it? Nope, he's going Whimsicott. Okay. If I can get this thing out of the way, then Sceptile can win. I can hit it really hard with Psychic, actually, if he's not defensive, which I think he's going to be defensive. Um, he was thinking pretty hard. He might have knockoff. What's knockoff going to do? He could, uh, he could Encore me into Focus Blast. Then I can go into Weezing. Knockoff is not going to do enough. So I think I'm going to click Psychic here. Psychic's going to be... Wow, he has the Shadow Ball, but the Kasee Berry! And Psychic is not quite going to get the kill, but I take his Choice Scarf! Wow! That is, like, insane! That turn of events was insane! What did you- Oh my gosh! That's incredible. I actually thought in my- In my, um... I actually thought in my prep that Magician was gonna come in clutch. And it did. Um, unfortunately, I'm not outspeeding anything else on his team. So it's locking me into a move, which that actually might work out to his favor. But once this thing is gone, then Shadow Ball is free. So... I'm gonna keep this thing around and go into Weezing. Weezing's fairly worthless right now. Okay, really nice play there. Um... I kinda just need to let Weezing go down, really. Uh, I could Memento here and go into Sceptile. If 
by Memento, go into Sceptile, throw off a power-up punch, then I think I win the game. Is that the play? I'm going to throw up a Toxic Spike, see what he wants to do first. Okay, he just explodes. Alright, so I'm glad I did not go for Memento. Now he has to go into... Man, this is crazy. Uh, a Chellarock might win me the game too. Oh, man. We're so close. We are on the cusp of winning the Little Oppressors League. We are in a great spot. Whimsicott has one turn left. I doubt he's running Synthesis. Um, Dragapult has to like find a way to wake up. And I can Memento right here if Dragapult comes in. Because... Dragapult, if I Memento, and then go into Mega Sceptile. I think I can live something. Yeah, I can live a Draco from Mega Sceptile. And that's if I wake up. Or that's if he wakes up right away, which I don't think he will. I think you have to be two turns asleep. Yeah, I think Sceptile wins us the game. I'm so mad I didn't get to use my Sandrush Lycanroc. That was going to be like the most powerful Pokemon ever. Sandrush Choice Band. It's going to be insane. Now I've got a Choice Scarf Hoopa. The Cassie Berry was so good. I did not think he was going to be running Shadow Ball. I actually missed Shadow Ball when I was looking at the team builder. Yeah, I missed it. I looked right over top of it. I looked at knockoff instead. Man. We're so close. If I lose this game, I'm going to be so upset. I'm going to take a bite out of my quickly melting Klondike bar really quickly. By quickly melting, I mean that boy is melted. <laughs> Probably got something on my face. So it depends on what he goes into here. I'm glad I stayed in and went for the other T-Spike. I definitely should win this game. With the amount of manpower I have right now. Even just like banded. Let me calc banded. Um, a shell rock. Shell rock does 46% max. So it's a 3 co. I'm going to get. I'm going to get hurt as well. I have to remember that. At this point, I don't know what if I want to risk Stone Edge missing. All right, so he goes into this. He might just uh, Perish Song. Uh, I think throwing off a Sludge Bomb is just a good idea. Just for liquidation. That does a lot, actually. Oh, is he banded? He might be banded, actually. Is that banded damage? Two fifty-two adamant. 
Why'd that do so much? Oh. Yeah, that's banded damage. That's crazy. Um, at this point, I'm just going to go for another Sludge Bomb. Or Memento, in case he switches out. Okay, goes into Dragapult. Memento was the play. Good stuff. Now, he's still asleep. And I can go for a Choice Scarf. Yeah, I can go for a Choice Scarf Shadow Ball. Throw it off. If he lives, he lives, which I think he might live, actually. Based on... Alright, Sax Wim's caught. Smart play. Back into Dugong. How much is a choice banded Ice Shard going to do? Ice Shard does not quite kill. So I think we're good. Adamant, choice band, 252 attack. Goes for Aqua Jet instead. And we live. And... He has to sleep talk Draco! Oh no! Oh, shucks. Okay. So... Okay. So now he is negative two. Uh, let's see. Mega Sceptile. He is minus two. Alright, Scale Shot should win if we hit. Because he can't take us out with Draco. We're going to click Scale Shot. Please! This might be a bad idea. If Scale Shot misses, then that's going to be really bad. Please live this. Don't get a crit. Come on. We're so close. We missed the Scale Shot. But he's slow. We're slower. Oh, he goes for rest. Okay. Please. Oh, no. Oh! Oh, my gosh. This is not good. Does Earthquake kill? Okay, now he is minus four. So he's gonna rest... I'm faster. I'm faster. Does Earthquake kill? It should kill. What if he's... Okay. Hold on. Okay. Max. Alright. Max HP. Max defense. Bold. Min roll for Earthquake does 24%. So we're going to click Earthquake. And we are the LOL champions! Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. What just happened? Oh my gosh. Wow, Z-Man. Great battle. I got so nervous there at the end. I like I was obviously calcing for like I I did not change my calc. I thought that I should have <sighs> I had offensive Dragapult, and that's why Scale Shot did so little. Which, if I didn't get four, if I would have gotten three, that would have been 60%, so he would have had 21 more. I would not have been able to kill him there, so I would have had to make a switch. Oh my gosh, that was insane. Your Carolina Crawdons are the Little Oppressors League champions. Oh my gosh, and Lycanroc didn't even hit the field. Man, poor Lycanroc. Good gosh.
Regardless, my Padawans, thank you for coming along in this journey. This is the first... This is the first Pokemon experience I've had in three years. I haven't played in three years. And I just won this league. I won eight matches, lost two. One of which I should have lost to this guy. And I beat the guy that beat me the last time too. So, man, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, which I really hope you did, go ahead and leave a like and a comment. Man, that was awesome. Thank you guys for joining me with this. Uh, really fun time. Had a really good season. Um, so, just thank you guys so much for getting me to this point, And uh, I appreciate every single one of you. Not many of you yet, but I think that'll change pretty soon. Regardless, hope you guys stay safe out there. Peace.